going on guys? T-Mart here and today they released the trailer for the second map pack in Call of Duty Ghosts. It's called Devastation and it's coming out in a couple of weeks on Thursday, April 3rd. So with this DLC we get three things. We get four new maps, we get a new hybrid weapon, and we get a new episode for Extinction. So let's go through these, I'll let you guys know exactly what you can expect. So starting off with the maps, all four maps are going to be small to medium size, which is like the best thing I've ever heard. Probably my number one complaint about Ghosts is just the fact that the maps are bigger than they've ever been in Call of Duty on just like a general scale. Like on average, it's the biggest it's ever been. And like I like big maps from time to time. They're definitely fun. But I also like those super close quarters maps where you're constantly getting engagements and right in the enemy's face and things like that. And I just, I don't feel like I get that enough in Ghosts. And that's probably my biggest complaint. But with this DLC, that might be answered. So... Starting off, the first map we get is Ruins. It takes place in a South American Mayan temple complex, and it looks like it's going to be super close quarters, like a lot of 90 degree angles and things like that, like fighting through this temple. It looks super cool. They said that it's going to be a triangular dot map, so that's good. I really like domination. I like when it's triangle rather than two people constantly fighting over beasts. There's going to be a lot of like flanking and switching around and things like that. And then also, there's an interactive volcano on the map where when you complete the field order, you can cause it to erupt, and it sends out these shards of like ash and molten rock and things like that that come down and they'll take out enemies. Kind of like the uh, the sabotage mortar strike on Warhawk, if you guys have ever gotten that. So that sounds pretty cool. Now next up, the second map we have is called Behemoth. And this one looks like one of the craziest maps we've ever seen in Call of Duty history. So you're playing on a giant, I mean absolutely enormous, Earth Excavator, which is essentially a giant saw that looks like it was spinning around and things like that. Like, it looked absolutely nuts. And they said it's a long, medium-sized map. So it looks like it's super long. It looks like it's going to be pretty good for sniper rifles. And they also said this really high up, so you don't want to fall off the sides, because you can fall down to your depth, kind of like you could uh, back in High Rise and things like that. So uh, that's pretty cool. That's pretty unique. And then next up, for the uh, the kill streak, he said the kill streak when you earn the kill streak. I think he meant once you you know kind of completed your field order, you get a helicopter and you're sitting inside of it with the open door, holding a mini gun, going around the map, killing people. So that sounds absolutely amazing. I can't wait to check that out. It looks like it's going to be pretty effective. Now next up. The third map that we get for multiplayer with this thing is called Collision, and this is the one that we saw yesterday in that teaser for the Ripper Gun. So this is where a container ship has crashed into a bridge, and they said it's flat, it's symmetrical, BDOM is elevated in the middle to where sniper spots can see it, and it sounds like it does have a little bit of long range battle, but for the most part it's going to be pretty close quarters. You're going to be fighting down in those tunnels that we saw yesterday, and in between shipping containers and all kinds of things, so this one sounds pretty cool. I can't wait to play that one, and then finally... The last map we get as a part of this map pack is a remake of Dome. Yes, that's right. Now, I know some of you guys are going to say, okay, well, I mean, Strike Zone is pretty much Dome. And yeah, it is. It's very, very similar. But this time, it's an absolute remake. Like, they're actually going to make it play the exact same way. Stairs going to be in the same spot. Vehicles probably going to be around the same spot, things like that. So, uh, they've reimagined Dome as an archaeological spot. And this one has one of the craziest twists out of all the maps. So, you get to call in three secret aliens from extinction. They're like the red guys that blow up when they get close to you and they'll run up to your enemies and blow up. And they showed like people getting like three and four piece kills. So I, I don't know how this is gonna work. I don't know how you earn those guys. I don't know if you need to get the field order or what's going on. But he also said that you can unlock the Venom X via an Easter egg, which is like the big badass extinction gun. And you can kill enemies by hitting them with it, so you can shoot them and direct impact them. But it also creates a timed explosive that will go off afterwards, so it'll kill pe other people running by and things like that. So that sounds absolutely crazy. It's a dome remake as an archaeological site where you can have aliens and alien weapons in multiplayer, which sounds absolutely nuts. We've never seen anything like that before. Now, uh, next up, the second thing you get, like I said before, is the new hybrid weapon, which is called the Ripper. We saw this thing yesterday. I put up a video about it. This thing is basically an assault rifle SMG hybrid weapon that you can switch on the fly. So if you want to go close quarter combat, go into SMG mode, you can spray from the hip, it's really good. If you want to pick somebody from far away, you can put up the, uh, the, the little red dot holographic sight type thing and you can shoot them from far away. So uh, that is pretty cool. Now the biggest twist about this weapon is it's available today for Season Pass holders. If you're a Season Pass holder on Xbox Live, you get this gun today. So as soon as I get that, as soon as I can download it, I'll bring you guys a gameplay. We'll probably do a breakdown of the weapon and things like that. So look forward to that. Now, next up, finally, the last piece of DLC you get with this map pack is the new Extinction episode. And I'm going to be honest, I didn't really complete 
the last Extinction episode, Nightfall. I didn't get all the way through it, so I'm not really sure where the story's at. Some of you guys might know better, but basically they said that it picks up where Nightfall left off. You're sent to a Chinese ship to find Dr. Cross and save her from Archer. There's a new alien cedar type of alien that he's kind of similar to the scorpion. He'll shoot like goo at you and stuff, but he'll also shoot out pods that turn into mutated plant-like turrets. So that sounds badass. Uh, there's also new crafting items where you can get up to four different variations of the Venom X. Like you find different parts, you create like, combine them with that Venom X, you can make different types of weapons. Uh, there's also the introduction of player's choice, where there's a bunch of different side paths you can go on where you can find weapons, money, locker keys, etc, etc, things that help you beat the game. And then finally it says that it culminates, like this episode culminates with a massive battle with a Kraken. It looks like you're on a ship, there's this giant, you know, sea creature Kraken type thing that comes out of the water and you're gonna have to fight him. And it said that this, it's incredible and it's an immense scale that we haven't seen before in Call of Duty ever. So uh, that sounds pretty cool. And hopefully I can get some gameplay of that for you guys. But anyway, there you guys have it. That is everything that's coming next up in Call of Duty on April 3rd with this new Devastation map pack. Let me know what you guys think. I'm super excited about this. I can't wait to play on some smaller maps and I can't wait to bring you guys some videos about it. So thank you guys so much for watching. Look out for my Ripper video coming out later today once I can download it. Thank you guys again. Catch you all later. Check out one of the other two videos on the screen. See you yet. Peace out.